Do you feel tired, exhausted? You feel like you're not getting things done. You don't feel productive. You don't feel effective. And you're thinking, ah, it's one of those days and I don't like it. And it's going to be one of those weeks and one of those months. And no, it doesn't have to be. I had one of those days yesterday and I thought, mm, I'm going to turn it around like that so that today I'm full of energy and I want to teach you how to do it in two ways. This is not about drinking more water and eating healthy foods and sleeping eight hours a day. Yes, of course, that's important, but this video is not about that. I want to teach you two ways that you can implement right away so that you can shift your energy level right away and stay till the end because there is a gift that I want to share with you in addition to this video that will really make sure to help you boost your energy. And I know it works because I'm using it and I'm teaching so many other people to use it as well. So let's do this. The reason I do this video is because really yesterday I had one of those days, right? I woke up and I thought, ah, you know, it's going to be one of those days and I just don't feel like it and I don't know really what I'm going to do and I'm just going to, I just, I didn't even think, I just dragged myself through the day and the weather was bad and my mood was bad and because of the weather was bad, my mood was bad and I didn't go out a lot and I didn't, oh, and it was just a vice of circle and anyway, I'm able to be aware of that and switch it around and I felt yesterday so bad and it made me feel like when I was in corporate. See, a few years ago I quit my corporate job because every day I was dragging myself to work. Every morning I woke up with a feeling, oh no, can I just hit the snooze button again? And I couldn't, I had to drag myself out of bed, drag myself to work, working for a boss and I hated every minute of it. And so now I'm actually living the life that I want and I'm in a new area again, a new house again, and I'm, you know, and I'm traveling the world doing what I love and that's what I help people to do. But yes, yeah, sometimes I have those days like yesterday and I'm being truthfully honest, not every day is rosy, right? But the fact is that now I know how to turn it around like that and it's just one day and moving on. So by the way, if you don't know me, my name is Rachel Smets and I really hope you enjoy my videos to help you create that life that you desire to have more freedom and be your own boss and be productive and work and doing what you love and that really gives you a lot of energy. So make sure to subscribe to my weekly videos every single Wednesday on YouTube. Hit that red button and the notification bell as well. What are those two ways? Number one, label whatever situation is negative to something positive. Label negative into something positive. If you have a situation that appears negative, you can immediately label that as something positive. How? Something good will happen from it. Know that something good will come out of it. See it as something positive and not just like, oh, it's one of those days and this is not working out and this is not the place I want to be and, I, and what will I do and who will I? No, you know very well that positive attracts positive and negative attracts negative. Your vibe, if you have a negative vibe, you will attract more negativity. If you have a more positive vibe, you will attract more positivity. But that's not all. In this comes the law of expectation. And that is really important. It's universal law of expectation that says that 85% of what we expect will happen. 85% of what we expect to happen will actually happen. Why? Because everything is here in our thoughts. If you wake up and you're thinking, ah, oh, this is going to be one of those days. Well, guess what? It's going to be one of those bad days because you print it in your thought and the whole day you expect it to be one of those days. And so you create it to be one of those bad days. It's just, it just, it's a continuous flow. Your, your thought is, is negative. Your vibe is negative. Your mood is negative. You attract more negativity and everything else is going to be one of those bad days. So it's just a continuous cycle. So your expectation, whether it's from people, 
from from your day from from attracting whatever you you expect is what you get so make sure that you're very aware of hey what am i thinking right now right so the law of expectation super super important what you sow you reap what you give you receive the positive vibe you put out you get back the way you talk to people you get back you you react angry to someone you get angry reactions back we know that right so it's just putting this into practice positive vibes only i don't know if you can see this behind me number two what do you focus on you know that what you focus on your energy flows to that so what do you choose to focus on do you choose to focus on something more positive or something more negative do you choose to focus on someone who's dragging you down i had a few conversations yesterday and some of them were like super motivational but some of them were like oh my gosh it just literally drained my energy so who do i choose so today i wake up and i'm like oh wait i'm gonna talk to this and this and this person and not that and that person who i know are not inspiring me or motivating me who i know are those energy vampires right and not the positive spirit so who do you choose to focus on what thoughts do you choose to focus on what positivity do you choose to focus on so this morning i woke up saying yeah today it's going to be a good day today i'm going to work out i'm going to go outside i'm going to i'm going to be energetic i'm going to make this video i'm going to talk to great people I am making that I am creating a good day and if today is gonna to be a good day which it is actually going really well my evening is gonna be good my next day is gonna be good and I'm back up so what I'm saying here is that it's so important to watch yourself and if you have one of those low energy days and you feel bad make sure you shift that around instantly because if you don't you'll dig deeper and deeper and deeper into that negativity so boosting your energy besides drinking and eating healthy and all of that yes it's important to sleep well and i feel better if i sleep eight hours than if i sleep six hours of course but it's a lot here we create ourselves we create our situations we recreate our life through our thoughts so label positive label situations if you do negatively label them into positivity and focus on the positivity and no life is not always rosy but you can make it well you can make it good you can make it positive i am now in a new house by the way where i don't know anything and i don't know anyone i don't know if i walk off the street where you know where the next one is or where i'll end up but i'm making it a good day i'm seeing it as something positive because getting lost means finding my way and that will make me happy again getting lost means finding a new routine means finding new people to talk to me finding you know i'm just searching around but i'm seeing it as positive i could see it as oh my gosh i'm feeling lost i'm feeling lonely i don't know anybody what will i do i could i could go on that trend no i'm not allowing myself to do that so what i made for you is a free pdf download with it's really a workbook a blueprint to shift your thoughts and reframe them to shift those limiting beliefs into more positivity if you read those examples and you work through it you can do it as well so make sure you download that it's in the link right below in the description as well in the comment and i just want you to realize you can make it a great day because you print it in your head so right below comment below how do you shift your energy how do you boost your energy how do you recreate and regain your energy please 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 comment your thoughts below and remember these two that i shared and what is your takeaway i want to know so remember subscribe to my youtube channel hit that button hit that notification bell comment below i want to know you're here i want to know from you i want to know if this is helpful i want to know if you have other tips and tricks let me know and i'll see you again next wednesday